Good morning, I'm Ana Harris here in San Marco where a number of businesses have unfortunately been forced to close down temporarily because of a fire that happened at Beach Diner over the weekend. So it starts here, you can see it, Seafood Island and Grill. They've got this sign on the door saying that because of the fire, they were going to be temporarily closed. But again, the fire did start here at Beach Diner and you can see how black the windows are. Even just looking at these signs, and you can see that there's that soot on the, on the windows and then there's the door that's boarded up. Look at the glass all over the floor. We're told that um, the fire crews had to bust the door in to get this fire out. Now we talked to uh, one of the co-owners of the wardroom and he tells us that his business sustained some smoke damage and he's two doors down and this one here as well, the right touch. They also, as you can see, are closed until further notice on their doors too. We're told they all share an attic so that smoke got into all of their rooms and um, so it's forced them to close down until they can get people in here to clean everything up and they've locked the doors so nobody else can get in but it's really unfortunate you can see that the wardroom here sells a lot of holiday decor so unfortunately you know this has happened right ahead of the holiday season so it couldn't have happened at a worse time so um, I know that they are hoping to reopen by the end of the week of course it's gonna take Beach Diner a little bit longer um, the cause of the fire too is still under investigation but as soon as we learn that we'll update you on air and online at firstcoastnews.com